Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Kahila or K, and today is a video about a crop top that I made last year and made a pattern on it, and I am making another one a year later, basically. Yeah, so I already finished the front panel for this top, okay? I started this top in my in a vlog and I showed it there and I was like, I don't want to start this video until I finish the front panel. So first off, let me show you guys the yarn that I'm using. So I had this yarn left over from another project that I was supposed to do. It was a knit project, but then I decided not to finish that knit project. I scrapped it and I saved the yarn just in case I wanted to use it later on and I was going to sell it, but then I looked at it and then I looked at my pattern. I was like, I feel like this yarn will be perfect for this pattern. So here is the yarn that I am using. It is the Petite Wool by We Are Knitters. I'm like, I have it left over, might as well use it. I am combining, I'm not combining these two together, but I'm using these two colors in the project. And I kind of was like, mm, this looks like it won't go together, but I want it to go together, so I don't care. But it actually goes together better than I thought. Did any of that make sense? I don't know. But these two together. So this yarn is, I think this is a worsted weight, honestly. Let's see. This yarn, let's see, it is 153 yards, 140 meters, it's 100 grams. You can use, what the, eight millimeter needles? Really? And then it says US 11. What's US 11? I don't, I don't go by the US. I go by 4.5, Anyway, I'm using a 4.5. I don't know what that is in US, whatever. But I'm using 4.5 millimeter crochet hook. And this is the Virgo hook from Furls. I only use Furls crochet hooks. So great. I have my scissors these cute scissors i'm using this green row counter i have stitch markers two balls of each color and i already used the balls because i already finished the front panel and i think that's it honestly yeah i'm following my pattern which will be linked down below for you guys and let me show you the front panel so Boom! So fixed it. Anyway, boom! Oh my gosh, doesn't that look so good? So the ribbing is this beautiful color right here, the lighter color, and then the panel. I decided to make the panel this beautiful, juicy, purple, maroonish, whatever you want to call it, color, because I don't think I made a top with this color before on my and so like when I looked at my Instagram I was like you know what let me let me make the this top part like the the panel part this darker color because I don't think I have a project with this color I might I might have to scroll but I was like I feel like the top will look really nice with the dark color and then for the like ribbing for it ugh. so it's gonna be sleeveless so I'm gonna have ribbing like on this side, like when I connect the front, the back panel to this front, it's gonna have like ribbing and stuff here and here. So the ribbing for that will be this color right here. And that's gonna look so good. I'm so excited. So it's like 11 p.m. right now for me and I just finished this front panel. I didn't plan to and then I was just on a roll so I was like might as well just finish it so I finished it and I'm gonna start the back panel tomorrow and yeah so this video might be short <laughs> but I just wanted to document my process and yeah just because it's like I made it last year and here I am making it again like the second ever top and I just I just really want to document it so see you guys tomorrow where I'll be working on a back panel.
Hi guys. Ooh, long time no talk it seems. Got my hair done. Ooh wee. And I'm currently sewing these panels together, okay? I'm gonna well slip stitching. I'm slip slip stitching from the end until like about like right here. And then this is like where the armhole will be. Something like that. But yeah, I'm done with both panels. I don't know if I told you guys that. Yeah, I don't remember like the last talking clip what I told you guys. Anyway, so yeah, this is what I'm doing right now. It's currently 8.32 p.m. I'm going to stay up to finish this top. Like I am not going to go to sleep until I finish this top because I'm almost done. Like I just have to sew both sides and then just do the ribbing around the collar and around the armholes and that's it. So, yeah, it's not going to be a lot, but I, if I were to guess, uh, with distractions, with watching videos and stuff, I'll probably be done by like 11.30. That's Malika laughing? Or Kalila? I don't know. Anyway, yeah. I'll guess around there, but I'll let you guys know when I'm done. Because if I'm distracted, it might be longer. And if I'm not that distracted, it might be a shorter time. Who knows? But, yeah. Let's get it. I'm back, guys. It is now 9.06. Okay, and my crappy, crappy toppy is sewn together. And now I just need to do the ribbing, which is going to be this color right here. So I just need to do the ribbing on the sides. Boop, boop. And boop, boop. And then I'll be done. I might try it on tonight for you guys. We shall see. Depends on how I'm feeling. Yeah. All right, let's get it. guys I have finished the armholes I hope these armholes are big enough for my arms to go through <gasps> oh my god it would be so funny if they aren't big enough but they should be big enough all right guys I have finished it this is what it looks like <laughs> it's so tiny oh my gosh it's gonna be like a sporty look I guess on me like a sporty crop I don't know we shall see. So this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. The armholes were just like a little too small. Like it, it's a little snug up here. But I like how it's like a bralette type. Like not like bralette but like sports bra e, if that makes sense. I don't know. I just, I really like that, and this is so cute, and I'm so excited to take pictures. <gasps> That's gonna be it for this video. Let me know what you think about the top. Also, let me know what you worked on while watching this video. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, and hit that subscribe button, and click that notification bell, because it will notify you guys whenever I post another video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.